Hello and welcome to Mule 4 training videos. In this video, we are going to talk about uh, some advanced features of uh, Mule 4 batch processing. In the last couple of videos, we have seen uh, how to introduce a, a batch job in the flow with a batch job and a batch step and uh, loggers in place of the processors. So um, this is a basic uh, uh, template to create a batch processing. So uh, we used this payload with uh, simple JSON with six records where we have seen how to process them uh, individually and we have seen what's the difference between uh, for each and the batch processes. And at last we have seen how to process them in two batches by setting the batch block size to three. So now let's see how to filter these records. More often than not, uh, we will be in a situation where we have to uh, process the records selectively based on some criteria. Say um, when record contains uh, students, uh, you might want to select them based on the age for eligibility. And uh, when there are some um, online orders received, you want to choose the orders that are already paid, so on and so forth. So in this uh, example, we are going to see, um, we are going to select the records uh, uh, whose record ID is even number uh, just for uh, demo purpose. So let's get into the demo. So this is the flow and uh, this is a HTTP listener to retrieve uh, records and we um, log the payload and this is a batch job where we have given the batch block size 3 so that we can choose uh, um, records in batches with a size 3. Now we are going to introduce the criteria under uh, batch step where you can see accept expression. So the criteria is going to be this payload.id mod 2 equals zero. So um, this is to verify. Sorry, we will introduce parenthesis. So this criteria is to choose the record uh, with the uh, record ID as even numbers. And uh, let's see how it goes. So I'm running the same job with uh, the same payload of uh, uh, six cricket players with whose ID is one two three four five six let's see the log so as you can see here now um, as usual all the records are processed uh, and uh, the even numbers are not getting uh, filtered out here. But there is a reason I have done this deliberately to indicate uh, uh, or give importance. So now we can note that the uh, incoming payload is JSON. But in order to apply this uh, accept criteria, it has to be a, a, a Java array element so that uh, it's treated as a key value pair. But here, uh, the incoming record is uh, like a JSON. You can note down the payload here. It looks more like a JSON rather than the key value pair. So now we are going to do a slight uh, transformation to do so. So we are going to transform the message. And instead of JSON, we are going to use uh, Java. And uh, we can use the payload as map and uh, we can use the same field ideas dollar dot id as number and uh, name we can maintain the same thing dollar dot name. so that's it so we have converted the incoming json into a key value pair of arrays and uh, you can note the criteria still the same payload dot id this id um, should be there in this uh, uh, payload. Let's run this. 
So the server is restarted. Let's see what happens. Now you can see uh, it's only one batch completed because uh, there are only three records in total. They are filtered uh, as only um, even numbered record ID are chosen. 